A community turned out today to show respect to a man who fought for our country but died alone. 24 Hour News 8's Emily Leonard is here with how people came together. Wayne Lee Wilson served in the Army during the Vietnam War. It was the funeral home that put the call out to the community to gather and honor Wilson, his life, and what he gave to his country. Wade Lee Wilson's obituary tells about the life of a man committed to his job, his country, and his fellow wounded veterans. But as you read on, it also includes this grievous detail. Mr. Wilson has no surviving relatives. Our affiliate WNDU in South Bend reports it was Wilson's neighbors and friends that asked the funeral home to arrange the service and put out the call to the community. When you heard about this, you refused to let a warrior be buried alone. So today in Niles, there was a celebration of Wayne Wilson's life and hundreds of people were there. This is exactly what a hero's farewell should look like. And of course, Mr. Wilson received full military honors. The mayor of Niles spoke, hoping Wilson's life will be a reminder to everyone. Appreciate your veterans. Grab that cup of coffee and share stories. Shake their hands and most importantly, thank them. For without them, there would be no us. Wayne Lee Wilson was 67 Wilson. years old and an American hero. Thank God for Wayne Wilson and thank you all for being a part of his legacy. It's just awesome to see how many people came wow, out. Wow, what hundreds a and hundreds. Heartwarming. Yeah, it's absolutely. Just a wonderful story. Yeah. yeah, they put that call out and everyone responded. That's right, from all over. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Emily. Emily, thank you.